Well, the cases of the new coronavirus are still low in the U.S., but a lot of people are wondering if the virus can spread in other ways, like on luggage or even through the mail. We had our Verify team look into it. Here's our Jason Puckett. It is difficult to think of cramped airlines or busy airports and train stations without thinking about spreading germs. We had a lot of folks asking us about the new coronavirus, specifically if the virus can spread from surfaces. For example, can the virus live on a package that's delivered to my house from China? Here's Dr. Nancy Massonnier, the director of the CDC's National Center for Immunization and Respiratory Disease. In general, because of the poor survivability of these coronaviruses on surfaces, that's sort of in the range of hours, there is likely a very, very, very low, if any, risk of spread from products or packaging that is shipped over a period of days or weeks at ambient temperatures. The key here, coronaviruses like this one don't survive long outside the body. So the risk of catching it by touching a package that's been shipped is low. The CDC said they have no evidence the virus has spread from imported goods. But what about surfaces in general? Like the handrails, doorknobs, even the luggage people are touching while traveling. Can I get the virus from touching those? Well, it is incredibly unlikely. Even if I sneezed into my hands and touched a doorknob, which you immediately touched after me, you wouldn't automatically get sick. The germs still have to get inside your body somehow. And remember, the virus can't survive for very long outside the body. Bottom line, it is highly unlikely you'll get the new virus from a surface or object. But in crowded areas, it's not hard to pass germs from person to person. That's how a lot of viruses spread, like the flu. Now, that doesn't mean you should sanitize your clothes or luggage. It simply means you need to avoid touching your face and wash your hands as often as possible. Good advice for this time of the year anyway. With your Verify, I'm Jason Puckett.